Hello everyone and welcome to the Dorothy DeLay Masterclass Series. I'm Dmitry Belinsky, Professor of Violin here at the College of Music at Michigan State University. And it's a real joy for me to welcome a wonderful violinist, very good friend, longtime friend, uh, Vadim Bluzman, who is joining us today. And uh, Vadim is a distinguished uh, artist uh, in residence at the Peabody Conservatory. And he's a world-class concert uh, violinist traveling all over the world. And uh, I'm really, really thrilled to have Vadim join us here today. Please welcome Vadim. There'll be two groups performing for Vadim. Uh, first group is going to perform uh, Sonata by Debussy, and it's uh, going to be played by Yun Miao Li and Mingu Liao. Please welcome our first group of performers.
range of intensity, and even as simple as dynamic range. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm afraid what, what, you, what you're doing is, is very musical, actually. Uh, it is just on a very small scale. I would like you to have broader shoulders, mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know, bigger lungs. Uh, I need everything to be more vivid in a way. Uh, maybe even without, I, I will argue maybe about some choices that you make. But I don't think they're significant, uh, my arguments. Uh, what I would like to do is take a magnifying glass and put it in front of you. Yeah, I, I would like to simply enlarge what's there. Then we will, because uh, a lot of what I heard, mm -hmm. I had to guess. Yeah, I had to guess what is it that you are saying. Mm -hmm. uh, so before I, I start saying I don't like it, or I do like it, I would like to know exactly what are you doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So let's let's start at the beginning. Uh, and I, I normally don't mingle into into uh, bowings or fingerings. I will only suggest one fingering, uh, and that is to reconsider harmonics here. Uh, in general, I think what you did in the beginning was a little bit inconsistent. You vibrated certain notes. You did not vibrate others it created a little bit of a limping phrase. When we have two notes, one vibrated, one not clearly not vibrated at all, mm -hmm. they, they become very different. Yeah? And in, to my ears, a uh, vibrated note is, is all, all, almost always heavier. So what I heard was, no vibrato, vibrato, no vibrato, no vibrato. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it, we are having this effect then. I would love to hear one one continuous five. Mm -hmm. So what I would try to try to say is four two one and then three two three one three. Yeah, j mm -hmm. just and this way you could you could give a little bit of warmth mm -hmm. to the first note. Uh, you don't have to uh, uh, torture yourself now. Do it. Do it. We'll do this in public. Just consider. Mm -hmm. Let now play your 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 fingers. Okay. Let's let's start. I already heard, uh, well, of course, you, you, are, you are starting without, without the vibrato, but then the, the very next note mm -hmm. is so much vibrated, and then the next one is not at all. Can we try to make it a little bit more consistent? Mm -hmm. Yeah? And then tell me, is it or is it No, 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 I gave you a choice. I love the second. The, I love the second. Yeah. You wanted. You wanted the second. In the, if that's the case, I'm not even going to tell you what I think. Uh, if that's the case, we have to make it clear mm -hmm. uh, uh, direction towards that last harmony. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In this case, what I'm asking you to do is even more important. Let's try. I would try to, the, for me, when we, when we t talk about uh, 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 French music of early 20th century, be, be it late romantic or, or in history, the direction of the phrase mm -hmm. is above momentary pleasures of playing on G string. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we love playing on G string. Yeah, we, I'm also a violinist. I, yeah, it all comes from, from one piece, mm -hmm. the Goyne violin. Yeah, we, we remember how good it is. 
skills to start that on G-string. And every time we come to G-string, there is this instinct of going into the, I don't think it's appropriate. Yeah, we have this, which is the indication of, of the, the phrase. He is t telling you to go to the, to the middle of the bar. I don't think this is so much uh, a direction to play loud. It's only direction to play. Okay. Let's let's take it immediately from and we are playing here. I'm now my micromanageable. But if you look at the way he's shaping the phrase, he is not making G the top of the phrase. It's not la da da yi da da. It's la da 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 yi da da. G is past the top of the phrase, and then it becomes a longer phrase. Mm. If you if you um, overcook the downbeat, mm. it becomes a square. La da 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 yi da da. La da 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 yi da da. Let's do it again, again from la da 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 yi da da. Right here, he says Amseran, right? Mm -hmm. What does it mean? Um, going going forward. Say again? Going forward. Mm -hmm. In physical reality, yes, but it means constricted. It means that the time becomes tight. tight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. It, it it will if we if you take me to court, you will win. Yeah, because you will need to play faster. But I think it it, it has to do with character. Yeah, maybe even more poignant than with with playing faster. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's let's try this. Uh, I would look for it in the intensity of sound. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe maybe try to look for for a, a hair closer to the bridge mm -hmm. and a hair more intense connection between the hair, hair and, and, and the string. Yeah, mm -hmm. let's go from do re mi fa do re sol sol do mi and make sure it is piano piano, mm -hmm. so you have a bigger range than to cover. Mm -hmm. Wonderful, wonderful. You did not, because you were busy looking for a more intense sound, mm -hmm. you didn't push the tempo so much, which I like. Mm -hmm. uh, it was not so drastic. Mm -hmm. it, I do think again it creates a, a, a longer line. Now, when we arrive in fourth, open your right hand. Yeah, make make sure that you are you are moving the bow. Otherwise, uh, otherwise it, it, it becomes it becomes uh, it, it still pressed. And he says, "A ah, tempo." Mm -hmm. So we we have to be that, which is again I think, is not just an indication of tempo. Mm -hmm. It's it's a matter of character. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can we take it from Amsterdam? <laughs> Don't push the tempo. Mm -hmm. And one. Okay. On scale, on now let me be violinist for a second. Uh, on scale one to ten, how uncomfortable are you? Hmm? Really, mm, seven. Seven. Yeah. So pretty uncomfortable. Think, papa papa kira, papa papa kira, papa papa. As it trick yourself into thinking that this is your uh, 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 mm -hmm. physical initiative comes from this first upbow. Papa papa kira, papa papa kira, papa papa kira. Those of us who have played Gladwell of Concerto, have you played it? No, no? Uh, but you know the, the, the famous place. Mm -hmm. 
papa para, papa para. If, if you give, it, it's very similar situation. If you give physical impact on the, on the up bow rather than on the down bow, mm -hmm. yeah, it it's not going to become easy, <laughs> but it will be easier, which is already a progress. Um, let's start right there, but Barcelona, a lot of pop up, and think of, of giving a little bit of a on the. Mm -hmm. no, you, you are already hitting the down bow, which means you're spending too much bow and you're running yourself into a corner. You're too high, mm -hmm. and then it's, it's a struggle for you to come back. Caress the first piece, don't, don't hit it. Pa, pa, pa. Yes. Very good. Now listen. Did it feel better? Yeah? Now, same thing, holding your bow four and a half percent stronger. Mm. Not, not, not five percent stronger, four and a half percent stronger. Just a little bit more uh, uh, resistance between fingers and, and the stick. Just a little bit. Try it again. Wonderful. Wonderful. Better? Yeah, combine both. You will be on more stable ground. Yeah? Uh, j just following this, we all play with this. What does he actually say? He says, You change the bow, you don't change the bow, it's of no consequence. It should be of no consequence. Mm -hmm. you, uh, ideally, I don't see a reason to, to change the bow here. But if, if you do, which is absolutely fine, it gives you a little bit more air. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean that you should change the bow stick. And then, if you actually go with what he says, you go away, go even further away, mm -hmm. then this becomes a real shock. Mm -hmm. yeah? don't, don't prepare. If, if anything, the opposite. It's not a compliment. Consistent bow weight and bow speed. Mm. Yeah, your your placement on, on the on the string is, is rather. It's it, it's wonderful for for uh, uh, security reasons, but I, I'm afraid it does not give you quite enough. And I, I can see that you want to do it. Mm. Yeah, you are either afraid or afraid. I'm quite sure you are. Um, one other thing, uh, please make sure that you are playing C sharp. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the difference. Mm -hmm. We are all often neglected, uh, neglecting this. Let's take it from from so re fa do re fa so re fa do re fa. As you are growing towards towards the, 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 the forte, make sure that you are controlling and conscious about the placement of the bow. I would move a little bit closer to the bridge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, of course, within reason, not to scratch and not, not to produce ugly sound, which I'm sure you want. But make sure that you are giving me more intensity in the bow. Maybe a little bit more precise articulation. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Let's try from bottom. Tiro pop 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 tiro pop pop pop. As you as you approach the top, yeah. Try try to look for the opportunities like this as as you go through 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 the moments. Uh, I I think these these moments will create the atmosphere that you 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 are using so well. Except you are not giving me the other end of the spectrum, and then I lose the sight 
of the atmosphere. Yeah, if, 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 if you don't give me sun, I will never know it's dark. Yeah, only when I see the sun will I realize we are in darkness and vice, vice versa. Um, can we go to please Menomoso and all of these segments uh, when we change? This is uh, four charts. Bar number um, 84, I believe. Um, everything changes. Yeah, the, 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 the harmonical essence is di different. He's asking you to, 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 to play rubato. It's, 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 it's a completely different story. Uh, it does not mean that you should hide. Mm -hmm. Yes, he's, he's telling you to, to, to play Sublatovsky. Again, it does not mean to play without, without sound. Yeah, I, I, I uh, of, of, often ask uh, my, my students what does it mean to play piano. Piano is, 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 is playing forte softly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I still need presence. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no matter what you want to do. You, you weren't quite secure. You, know, you didn't know how many. Mm -hmm. Let, let's go with four sharps, please. into that left for, for further corner. Y your sound has to travel there. I, I love your, your, the quality of the sound. I, I'm just sorry that it stays here. Mm -hmm. I think we should share it with, 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 with others. It, for four bars, play, 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 play by memory. You, you know this one. Please. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Your mindset, mm -hmm. brilliant, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I did think you, you use now too much bow. You, mm -hmm. you, you maybe overcompensated. Mm -hmm. But in essence, that's, that's what I was, I was trying to do. You, you have beautiful color, but you're keeping it to yourself. Yeah, I need it to, to come out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, every time we have a tempo change throughout the movement, throughout, especially throughout this segment, I don't think we need to stand there with the with uh, 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 announcement, I've changed the tempo, mm -hmm. or, or I'm going to change the tempo. It, I, I think, again, the, the, ch the changing of the tempo is a, a, a matter of character and not so much of a speed. Yeah, you, you understand? Yeah. Uh, so I, I would try to find more of a suave uh, shaping of, of, of changing. It, it was, to, to my ear, too, too obvious. Mm -hmm. I, I would try to make sure that um, every time you come back to, to higher note, that it appears and not begins. Yeah, there was a very clear ah! mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, I would love it to, to, for them to just realize that this note has, has come back. Can we take it, please, from, um, this is bar 133, and I want you to consider this. We have a ritenuto mm -hmm. to a tempo. What does this mean? Mm -hmm. What tempo is that? Um, it's the Absolutely, yeah. it's the meno, it's yeah. poco meno. Mm -hmm. What, what happened here, this is actually more maybe for you. This a tempo is not, uh, uh, is exactly what you wrote here. It's not as fast as tempo primo. Mm -hmm. Then tempo primo has to, has to move with your help. Your quintuplet has to be rather uh, active in left hand, not in the right. Mm -hmm. Can we try please from one, 133? Yeah, you, you, you start four bars before that. Uh, the the poco meno. Yeah, and, and don't don't be don't be shy with, with that. That that really could could sit. Even even even, even quieter, not 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 slower. 
simpler take, but quieter in style. <laughs> is speeding up. How about just for, and it, 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 you are not original, we all do the same thing. We, we're told to, or we think playing, playing rubato and we immediately run. Try, try to, try to actually take time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Rather than Let's try it. That was beautiful. Thank you. this was beautiful now let's do the same thing playing for them mm -hmm. not kid not being totally egoistic <laughs> let's let's give them the music once again the same place please Co -co 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 That's the direction where I, where I would go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, following the same idea as mm -hmm. as, as we did before, um, and then again, this the same. Mm -hmm. Now, what I would love to find is 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 a way for this a movement, and then following stretto, to have one mm -hmm. line. You have, you know, if you drive a car, I, mean, I can imagine you do. You have driven uh, a, a stick shift mm. when you can change gears oh, but you know it exists mm. it, it, uh, there, there were at least two gears changed mm. <laughs> I would I would love to have one meaning uh, drive automatic car here yeah so it is it is it is very very smooth mm. I felt I felt this was much too sudden mm. yeah mm. Um, can we take it maybe from Amomondo um, Etenu? This is 204. Okay. Oh, you don't have bar numbers. No. Uh, it's pure, pure piano before it doesn't have bar numbers. Bar number um, two oh four. I don't think it is he's um, um yeah he's telling you to go away. I would I would listen. Try. Wonderful. 
for my, and this is, uh, your, you, you like tomatoes, I, I like potatoes. I feel this is much too much of a vitamin too. Mm -hmm. it, has, it has a finality to it. Yeah, I, I'm almost expecting the, the movement to end. Yeah, I would, I would prepare it maybe a little bit there. I need constant feeling of direction. Uh, 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 otherwise, it, the music stops. We, we stop the heartbeat. Mm -hmm. Can we do this again? Mm -hmm. of tempo I thought this was this was much more uh, much smoother uh, can we make sure that we are becoming much more intense now uh, I would suggest maybe not using so much bow mm -hmm. yeah the the more intense you get I would make the board a little bit more compact a little bit more grounding mm -hmm. yeah a little bit more 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 control here uh, can we take it from a moment Much better. Okay, let's go to the next one. Otherwise, we'll never get it. Beautiful.
wishes for the First Amendment are, are remaining the same. Uh, I, I, I'm yearning to, to get more vividness mm -hmm. out of you. Yeah, I, I, I would like to, everything to be, to be more clear. Uh, it it, it uh, often reminds me of, of uh, drama actors. Yeah, if you, if you uh, listen to them speak from stage, if you are close to them, mm -hmm. everything sounds exaggerated, <laughs> yeah, pronounced. Mm -hmm. I need a little bit of this in your playing. Uh, in order for your message to, to, to cross the, the threshold of the stage, no matter if, if, uh, where, where we don't actually have a stage, but there is a distance that uh, physically sound needs to travel. And every uh, idea of yours needs to be carried from to. Uh, I do think we need to play with, with a certain feeling of exaggeration. Yeah, what, what you feel is enough here in, in your immediate vicinity. It, it truly is not the case, even three and a half meters away. Mm -hmm. And say we were in a, in a, in a larger uh, room, yeah, then it, 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 it changes even, even more. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Uh, Let's, let's start from, 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 from the beginning. Uh, I would love to understand that these four bars, until your quasi cadenza is one thought. Yeah, right now, I, I, I heard the first bar, then there was a tonic in the, sec in the second bar, and then finally we arrived in the G string and played louder. I would like it to be connected. Yeah? Uh, Bow faster, finger slow. That's basically what, what, what we'll say today. I think. Yeah, please. And make sure we have enough of it. Aya, aya, aya. Of temperature. Mm -hmm. 
every time we come back to there is a tradition to play this section considerably faster you are not playing it considerably faster you're just playing it faster a little bit and i would love to hold on to the same uh, uh, heartbeat yeah mm -hmm. it is it is the reason why we play it faster is because it's easier of course yeah we're we're violinists here we know um i would love to have this suspended in the air character which is impossible i i, I believe if we play it too fast it becomes virtuosic mm -hmm. and I, I i really don't think this is a virtuoso music actually mm -hmm. not at all um can we take it maybe from this bar 13 ah, you, from, from, from. Yeah. Maybe think think of the tempo you, you you want to start it's quite a bit slower than what you were playing so far mm. I need more. Show me, show me the direction of phrase, not by speeding up, mm -hmm. but by intensifying. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there, there is. A, it's a, it's it's a bit of a meditation. It is. It is re repeated note. Yeah, you are you are you are in a way obsessed with this idea. Mm. Try it again. Three and. It's more difficult. It is more difficult. What I suggest here, uh, I, I do think that you are using a little narrow bow mm. for my taste. I, I would give it a little bit more more chicks. Mm. Maybe a little more, actually a little more bow. Mm -hmm. Not so vertical. And um, as, as, as you are playing it, use the melodic line to create the shape. Mm. Now, this is very important. We're going from pianissimo to piano. Very often, you know what happens here, traditionally. Subito. Yeah, yeah it is really wrong. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's, it's something we do by, by, by default. Yeah, the computers come with this chip. Yeah, crescendo and piano means playing louder, then su su suddenly softer. It, it's really not the case. Yeah, it's it's pia it's crescendo from pianissimo to piano. Let's go from Amovon, uh, bar nineteen. A little more brush, just a little. Mm -hmm. Don't brush. that character for these eight bars or whatever, however many these are, then this, um, babi, then this jazzy mm -hmm. uh, 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 interlude will really take an effect, I, uh, I, be, I believe. Otherwise, it becomes one uh, uh, un unrecognizable uh, line, mm -hmm. unrecognizable in terms of, uh, in terms of uh, um, character. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I, I do think this, 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 this is helpful. Now, uh, please disregard. Pizzicato. Yes, uh, uh, you will never play pizzicato too loud. I promise. Mm -hmm. Can we start it from 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 your left hand solo? Your pizzicato and play. I, I, I'm standing one meter twenty centimeters from you, and I can't hear you. Play for that once again. And let's let's not push the tempo. Very good. You see this? Mm, yeah. How are you going? 
going to do it. I would I would start from the string mm -hmm. and move the bow. Yapa. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. Uh, I, I had a teacher once who taught me to play the staccato left hand by screaming, "Block harder! <laughs> block harder!" Um, and now I'm going to do the same to you. <laughs> Please block harder. Same place. Please. performing arts. Uh, I needed to be clear that now it is also yours. You were secondary for, for quite a while. Now you're saying even though it is pianissimo, the, the, the uh, articulation changes. Yeah? If, if, if only because you're going from uh, pizzicato to arco. Can we start right, right there? Once again, once again, pop, 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 pim, and, and, and it's, it's C sharp, not D sharp. Pop, pop, pop. Good. And now another consideration. He changes the articulation dramatically. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think we need to acknowledge that. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm being I'm micromanaging, but I, I do think this is this is important. We are coming home, mm -hmm. but we are coming home with a changed people. Yeah, uh, you went through whatever you went through. Your your vision is different now. It's no longer pianissimo. Your your articulation is is clearly broader. Yeah, a little bit more present, a little. Even more chicks. Can we try? Um, I don't know. Uh, two bars before that. A little bit more present. Very good. A little bit more present. A little bit more vocal. Straight there. Sando here, rapapira, papapira. I would love to hear a little bit more of rapapira, papapira, 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 just a little bit more sparkle. And for you, it, it is espressivo. Yeah, uh, uh, yes, piano, but uh, piano that needs to have a presence. You, you're automatically, when you see letter P, you take the bow away from the string. It's only it, piano is sunset. It's it's blue. It's it, it, what, whatever. You, it's a, it's a character. It's it's a color. But it's it's not playing without sound. That's certainly what, what it's not. Good. Um, can we take it uh, four bars before this? Four. Bar? I would milk it. 
much more. I would I would start earlier. I would I would s s slide slower. Mm -hmm. I think this is what would make it uh, uh, espressivo. Mm. Can we start that bar immediately? Rock of Tiro. Tiro. Now crescendo. no indication of holding back mm -hmm. if anything he is preparing one mm -hmm. crescendo with direction forward can we take bar before that exactly what you play now and now open good now multiply by seven and a half and we will be there neglect uh, when we play with the piano, especially when we're in, in unison or in octave, a pure interval situation, mm -hmm. is blend of sounds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there is one thing that piano is, well, that more than one, that the piano as an instrument cannot do. Mm -hmm. What is it? Crescendo. Uh, that's one, absolutely right. Yeah, sustain equal sound. Uh, what, what else? They can't vibrate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and for us to 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 use excessive vibrato, mm -hmm. and you, yours is very tasteful. You have a very beautiful, uh, uh, warm, natural vibrato. I, 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 I don't I don't have anything anything to complain. But when we use it to such extent in the situation of a unison, the the intonation immediately is questionable. Not because you're playing out of tune. Yeah, simply because your sound is so different than what is produced by the, by, by, by the piano. Mm -hmm. I would give more attention to the expressivity of the right hand rather than immediately shake. Mm -hmm. It's natural for us to do it, it's normal, we, especially in, 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 in a melodic situation like this. But we have to consider the, the, the reality. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm shown that we have to stop. Beautiful, just give more. Yeah, yeah thank Bravo. you very much. I didn't even touch your violin, but it was such a descriptive. <laughs> I already touched it. <laughs> Hopefully, you'll, you'll have a chance to open it, just to, to show. <laughs> so we have a second group performing Schubert uh, last moment from the piano trio number two. Uh, we're going to welcome Chang Li, piano, Yu Xin, violin, and Min Zhang Chan, cello.
consistency of choice. Meaning, um, in, in music of this person, uh, there is so much information uh, that, that, that he gives in the way that he describes his music, in the way that he writes in articulation. And for, for me, uh, the majority of character choices will come through articulation. Mm -hmm. Of course, there is volume, but uh, this, is, this is not uh, Gustav Mahler or, or, or Richard Strauss, where uh, there, there will be a sweep of, of energy. Here we, we speak through differentiation between an accent, a forzando, a, 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 a momentary diminuendo, uh, things like this. They actually make a difference. Uh, you often um, sometimes disregard, you, you often unify them. Uh, let's say, uh, I often felt that there was no difference between uh, a, a accent, for example, and forzando. And I think these are two, two dramatically different gestures. Let's, let's maybe establish what is an accent, first of all. Any? Theory. Have a bite at the beginning of the note. Okay, you are describing to me how. how okay. Yeah, I, I always try to encourage students to think for, first of all what. Yeah, we put horse in front of the carriage. We, first, we need to know where we go, and then we say, well, first left, then right, and etc. But for Schubert, I thought maybe different composer they have a different absolutely taste yeah. of the accent. So yeah. what? How 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 do you feel? And I feel the classical period is more elegant style mm -hmm. of the accent. Wonderful. Not too, yes. Not too harsh. Not Wonderful. Uh, I'm with you. Mm. I, I I I agree. And yet I I I need you to 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 consider something else. Look at this sign. Does it remind you of anything? What does what does accent look like? The key. So it means they have this like this crescendo at the accent is a very quick diminuendo. Mm, quick yeah, in, in music of, of uh, certainly for Mozart and for Schubert. Mm. Uh, Haydn certainly. Uh, Beethoven uh, late Beethoven starts to be starts to be different. But essentially uh, mm. Even even in Brahms, mm. uh, accent is a, a decrescendo, a diminuendo. Yeah, and meaning accent is not an, an, an emphasis. Accent is a release of energy. Yeah. Uh, so if we were to draw a, 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 some kind of a, 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 a graph, how, how it looks like, it will not be like this. It will be like this. The, uh, there still will, will be an element of emphasis only because of the quickness of release. So it will not be ta, it will be ta. This is the, the first that I, I would need you to, to, to think because there are many accents. Mm -hmm. yeah, and, and I do think they're quite meaningful, but they, uh, quite often when you play them, they become emphatic, they become uh, uh, mighty. And I, I don't think, th 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 what you described now, uh, elegant and, and uh, uh, not, not, not so aggressive, you, that did not happen. Only, only because of, it, it, I think it's just a matter of attitude. Yeah, of I I your, your expectation, what is it that you are expecting to hear. So, as a general comment, when we see accent, let's maybe try to avoid immediate uh, uh, assault. Yeah, we will we'll, we'll occupy Poland a little later. Um, let's take it from the beginning, from the beginning of the movement. And I I immediately a question, is it rapapatim or is it yapapatim? I think like the, the first one. That's how you play. And I, I, I believe uh, it takes away from elegance. When we overcook down a uh, beat, a uh, down beat. Uh, I think I think it becomes it becomes too explicit. I would I would phrase off in, in this case. Maybe 
it may be just a little, a little bit closer to the great note. Tra -ta -ta. Almost, almost to an extent of, of, of double stop. Almost. Don't don't push the tempo forward. Consider that we will have you will be in trouble later on, which you do brilliantly. But make sure make sure that you are you are not pushing yourself too far. Can we take it from ra pa pa pi da 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 da? Just four bars before we get to it. Bar twelve. Pick up to thirteen. Ra pa pa pi da di da da. Essentially, they are the same gesture, just it takes different amounts of or the different amounts of time. La da 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 di. I would not say di da 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 di. La da 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 di. Tria pa pa pi da da. Do not do not neglect it. I think I think the 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 phrasing actually is if if you only follow what he writes, I think it's a phrasing is 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 there for you. Can we take your pick up to twenty one two three four? This is very uh, string-like behavior. Down bow means heavy note, not at all. The top of the phrase is C. Good. Uh, same place, please. Um, when, 
when, when we play sugar, when, when I play sugar, I, I'm always looking for this childlike na naivety, yeah, which, which has sophistication of, of, uh, of a wise old man. But the essence is, is, is very naive. So this exuberant C, 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 as if you, you, you can contain yourself only to find this terrible drama. So do, don't rush into it. Yeah, bring our attention. Uh, wonderful before. Let's go from Fortissimo. Do mi so Bar 40. 40. <laughs> In 45, when you, when you play subito piano, it's up to you when the clock ticks. Yeah, the, the time is in your hands. You are the master of the universe. Whenever you say, ra, pa, 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 that's when it happens. I, I would not rush into it. I think this is a very poignant moment. Uh, it's a kind of a turning, turning moment. Yeah, I, I wouldn't rush into it. Let's go to, to list session. Let's, let's take maybe... Um, same place, the uh, bar 66, and go into, into the next section. Sorry, I have to say, I'm making work. 66. <laughs> You're playing ultra staccatissimo 16. Da 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 tim pom 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 di. This is kind of a, 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 a melody or, or, or music that never begins and never ends. Mm -hmm. I would not like to hear la da 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 Imagine that somebody opens the window mm -hmm. and it just appears in, 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 your, in your room. It, it hasn't started, it hasn't finished, it's been always there. Mm -hmm. It just at this moment you happen to notice. So, uh, technically speaking, maybe don't throw the ball on the string. Mm -hmm. No, make, make, make sure that your fingers are controlling it on the stick. Mm -hmm. let, let's, let's take la pa 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 pim pam pam. Let's connect it. 
C minor, C minor, C minor, C minor, and then we have we have tension that deserves uh, uh, intensity. Okay. <laughs> If anything, the, I, I think I would think of this legato part as a relief. You are going back to home tonality, which means a release of energy. It does, it does not mean, mean an emphasis. Let's try it again. And we come to the next uh, phrasing corner, which is forte piano. Uh, I missed b almost all of them. Mm. For me, forte piano, and maybe I am wrong. Uh, I, I haven't exchanged any any Facebook messages with Schubert today, but I think this is the most dramatic of, of them all. I think it's even more dramatic than than uh, Sforzando, simply because of the range mm -hmm. of, of the, the dynamic difference. Mm -hmm. I, I think it deserves much more attention, much more, more uh, uh, um, fall, so to speak, from, from forte to piano. Uh, to me, this is, this is really not enough. Um, can we take second uh, time? Second time. Simply louder, please. At least, at least, don't be shy. Other, otherwise, it, it becomes uh, passé. It, 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 it has it has no presence. Once again. I'm not going to torture you in public, but consider playing it uh, off, off the string, middle to the, to the, between middle of the frog, lighter, lighter, uh, uh, more elegant. It becomes a little bit too, uh, for, for lack of a better word, too, too Germanic. I think it's not elegant enough. And then again, for the piano, you guys together is bar 104. You, you, you are, you're neglecting it. I, I think it's a pity. Um, can we take your second time? Uh, bar uh, 97? starts going up so you so should you you should go up with it beautiful um, let's let's go on from from, from here um, uh, I admire your pearls wonderful uh, my dear soloists and I don't mean soloists as compliments I do think we should we should be mindful yeah you, you do realize that there is one million and a half notes 
yeah, we, we need to we, we, we need to be basically your whole uh, hearing apparatus should be directed there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you are you are the support system. Um, can we start to st straight there from from uh, exactly? Thank you. Uh, yeah, one one two one one twenty one mm. double bow. Mm. What you did now, I like quite, quite, and I don't know if, if this was by design. You stop marching. You actually created a longer line, which was absolutely wonderful. When you played it the first time, I, I felt it was much too too overly articulated. By doing this, you are pulling the blanket onto yourself, and I don't think it's legitimate here. What what I would I would emphasize the fortissimo. Yeah, this is this is this is something you could do. But in between, I would stretch the net as, as long as long as I could. Beautiful. Let's, let's do this again. That, that becomes the he's re re-emphasizing the the, the 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 harmony by 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 giving it another chance. I think it's important. What I would try to to, to do is maybe not to to give too much in for example bar one thirty one. Mm -hmm. Yeah save enough for bar one thirty two. Okay. And then the same thing uh one thirty five not too much. Yes it is fortissimo mm -hmm. but we have to realize that we have to we have this gesture the next bar. Okay. Yes, please. One to nine. Thank you. 
one is. A uh, couple of things. Uh, uh, this is uh, starting in bar 145, when we're going between subito piano, subito, subito forte, subito piano, subito forte. I, f I feel with you how you are trying to keep it in tempo. God forbid you, you take a breath. Don't feel under pressure. Yeah? Yes, it is quick. It, uh, it, it is very demanding. And there are many different voices, uh, and you're passing on one to another. God willing, you will be able to catch Fine, but let's let's not uh, push ourselves in, in, into the corner. By you're you're almost rushing. Yeah, I, I would try to take a back seat. Yeah, can we take it from same place? C. <laughs> shorten this note and if anything I would exaggerate yeah the, the for, the, I think the, the dramatic effect is very important and it is up to you again yeah you are again the master of the universe the moment you are alone it's all yours yeah I, I don't think so no nobody is going to stand here with good uh, four part and four D please Yeah, I really have. 
I feel that, um, first of all, for, for strings, la da da dee, bom, bom, it becomes too aggressive. Mm -hmm. Yeah? These are only accents. I, I'm returning to the same idea as, as we talked about at the beginning. Mm -hmm. uh, th these are releases rather than assaults. Ra da da dee, bom, la da da dee, bom, bom, bom. I would also not maybe actually stop the ball. Dee, da, ding, boom, 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 boom. And then when it goes to you, I would, I would have an attitude rather of legato. Yeah, since he does not even write accents, well, it's, it's a more of, uh, the nature of the instrument is, 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 is quite a bit different. It will equalize the, the if, if we are not so aggressive in strings, and, and you are playing it on a more, more horizontal plateau, it will equalize the, the articulation. Let's take it from um, E, fortissimo. Can you do it again? Yeah. 17, oh. yeah, on the B-flat major. Mm. Yes, what, what happens here? We have 5-1, yeah, mm. harmonically speaking. Mm. Do we emphasize resolution or we, 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 we stay away? Mm. I don't know. Stay away. We stay away, of course yeah. we stay away. Uh, Piano has forte piano. We out. Oh. Or if you emphasize, then you stand up, take your bow and leave. <laughs> that's that's the, the only uh, 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 situation when you in music like this, when you can emphasize the individual at the very end. Yeah? Can we take it from forte? Uh, this is 214. Can we do the same thing please? 214? Child who has all, all the 
folks, but knows they're not coming to. Uh, and I would love to be able to breathe, especially when, when he's giving you the release options. When he gives you this, this, this uh, accent, make sure you pay attention, which means, in, for me, allowing it time. I'm not, taking, I'm not talking about uh, slowing down, not at all, but allowing it time, allowing it its value. You're pushing through it, and, and as a result, you don't have the time to notice. Mm -hmm. And then uh, pay attention when, when, when you are alone. It's pick up to 251. 251. Yes. It's not. No, 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 no. It's. Do you have you, you, you have a little note there, right? Yes. see that you are trying but you know that there is physical reality um, and that was, was so beautiful really uh, right there la, da, da, di, in, ba, there is a pick up to 261 Since we're in inside triplets, yeah, mm. it should not become intense rhythmically. Mm. Yeah, the, 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 whatever we, we call it, it is a memory of. Yeah, it's not in, in, in our present. So what what I would love to hear is is, is a kind of a relaxation, yeah, kind of a spread rhythmically speaking. Mm. If if you choose. Uh, uh, to, to take a little time here, nobody will, will uh, uh, blame you. Yeah. Keep 
does say it does it, it seems to be it does say a question after you yeah it, it's it, it's quite quite uh, uh, poignant yeah so again it's to do with time time is is, is everything in this let's go uh, <laughs> Long, 
but it, it, it ends up in terms of finding meaning in the music. Uh, uh, I, I encourage you, one, one thing to, to, to do is to uh, really carefully to pay attention to uh, what he writes. Mm -hmm. yeah? I don't know what is right and what is wrong, but I know that when you pronounce a sforzante in one way, I would expect it to be pronounced in at least similar way mm -hmm. the next time around. In the way the first time you say you pronounce an accent in what, whichever way you do it, I would like it to be the same next time. Yeah, the, and he does uh, build phrases th this way. So I think it's important. Mm -hmm. Bravo. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. involved in, a, in a, such a kind manner and even without you know imp <laughs> imposing his beautiful sound uh, on the instrument but it was so descriptive and, and it was I think important for all of us to remember that uh, we have to really treat composer texts and all the remarks and all the indications with uh, with all the respect and uh, especially in this music we can find so much details and nuances and it was wonderful that you really pointed out the importance and difference in interpretation of those very small details which makes such a great difference and within this hour we could all feel and see how those details are make this uh, enormous difference and the music sometimes depends on how we treat small details and, and approach uh, the character and dynamic and, and make the phrasing but in this particular music it's our I think our role is really to 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 pay attention to those details and to be able to respect every every single nuance and it already makes such a great difference and your demonstration and your uh, your session just really remind all of us how it's important and in a way it's very simple because we really need to just pay attention and respect to the composer. Yes. Well, you remember David Walter is here who was, he was a double bass teacher. I, I could hammer you with this thing. He would always say the same thing. Disregard the composer. <laughs> but first give him a chance. <laughs> I, th I, I do think we always do that. I mean, the, the Schubert can come here and say what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, we, we are the representatives of the music. I think it's, it's our responsibility. So I think it's we, we started a very good tradition. You you were one of the first guest artists last year of the Art Delay Masterclass series on Zoom. And uh, we all owe to you, uh, being part of the Art Delay Studios. We met mm -hmm. during that time. Uh, I'm sure there are many stories uh, we can share with students and the audience. We don't have much time for this. But at the same time, uh, as you know, David Delay was a graduate of Michigan State University yeah. in 1937, and thanks for uh, support of uh, Lauren Harris, who is here. We're able to start this series and hopefully will continue in the future. And I really would love to see you come back here and uh, share your talent, your your expertise, your, your ongoing process of evolving and learning. And it, 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 I think it's the most attractive, for me, part of your personality. You're very young in spirit and you're always looking for this inspiration through music. And definitely you're able to share it with all of us. And I thank you again for being here. Thank you. Thank you.